Valorant and its players piss me the f off, so I've compiled the funniest and most downright disrespectful ways I've expressed my unbridled rage. No one's safe. First of all, f you. You got the rank you deserve, you stupid ass smooth brain instalock lurking bitchless mo. And this is why their dad left and why their crush don't like him. You deserve an instant one month ban, or at the very least, the electric chair. Basement dwelling monks who swore vows of silence listening to the game on their McDonald's headset from work. You have no life, no friends, definitely no girlfriend, and you're ugly. So you got picked less than the wheelchair kid in the dunk contest. A Pete Gold won trying to boost someone playing their first FPS because she's the only one that will play with him. Good thing Riot has pictures and no one would know what map we're on. More lost than Zoro. He's never got picked in sports because they're fingers were literally made of butter and they're about as graceful as drunk leaf. You're a fucking loser. It's a screeching, baiting, smooth brain, eating mayo a tub at a time children. So you try to hide behind the throwing kid that has to solo queue because everyone finds you annoying. How do you remember your Valorant login or how to eat without putting a fork in your fucking eye? That's where the bitches are at, but still won't talk to one. Do not talk to a girl have the mental stability of charles manson it's plain burger with just ketchup eating kid you'll do missionary with your right hand your whole life drop out after they can no longer count on their fingers in math class brain dead smite knife having webcam mic using weird champ you dense fucks Tarek wannabe with the social skills of jason r literally dog shit and potentially brain damaged who sucks more <laughs> than your mother so she can afford you a birthday present or some beta c cancerous toxic sucks that roe v wade got overturned because they should have been a pieces of shit. I'm just convinced that they're playing without a monitor, mouse in their offhand, and half a keyboard. 13 year olds that thought they were just hilarious, when in reality they're plagued with crippling depression after years of bullying because they're just so fucking annoying that people can't stand their existence, and they're the sole reason their parents split up. Put them on a watch list because I feel fucking terrorized. Brain dead monkeys. I feel like I'm on 21 and counting babysitting these kids whose parents are ashamed of them. Pretend like you made better financial decisions and are able to afford such an illustrious vacation and that you're not a depressed person who has no real human connections and searches daily for something to make themselves feel alive. So they play video games every day in order to escape reality and scratch that itch for adventure and danger you felt since you were a child. Okay whose only hobby outside of Valorant is eating a well-balanced diet of Doritos and Mountain Dew middle school dropouts who drool on themselves. You're just poor. I'm prepubescent Adderall addicted kid before you get your adult diapers and a bunch of little piss babies. You play like some brain dead Terminators if the Terminator couldn't communicate, missed all its shots, and was racist. You can't aim, so you Michael J. Fox shaky ass motherfuckers only win gunfights when I Ray Charles cosplay with ADHD Adderall popping fucks. Playing like this is why you always solo queue. You fucking shitter, are you practicing and crouching on all those c <laughs> you spend a little too much time thinking about douchebags can't aims hide with shotguns and you tell spammers why don't you calculate how to get some bitches and not only do their friends hate them but everyone that cues with them does too it's high schoolers heartbroken over a girl they've never even talked to with ethernet cables attached to their nipples pause granddad preteen anorexic jason r wannabe a virgin sexually repressed cuck that punches holes in their walls andrew tate's love child with jeffrey dahmer e-dating a tommy lauren clone but a tad immature with loads of repressed trauma. Y'all are full disgusting. Fall asleep with a lit candle. You looking more lost than Columbus? You're literally more brain dead than a lobotomy patient. Even your friends hate you. Oh, you're not trying? What are you trying to be an 80s high school bad boy? Not trying hasn't been cool in decades. I bet you believe that girl doesn't like you because she's dumb, huh? You fucking incel. Introverted cheese smelling peeps on his stepmom. Doesn't wash his underwear looking cuck. Fucking cunt. Asinine. Feeble minded crayon eaters. And these are actual NPCs. As the hand eye coordination of Captain and hooks if Andrew Tate dick riders and discord mods had a weird cousin love baby 13 year old that looks down and can't see their own toes they're at max 5 7 and definitely drive lifted trucks smooth brain melons imagine being such a fucking loser that you have to pay for a boost just to find somebody cute with now I hope one day I run out of things to express how insanely emotional and immature my teammates are but that's not happening anytime fucking soon because riot has a lab that literally 3d prints incels it takes the worst people's DNA and combines them into these abominations I have to call teammates fuck off